The Martin Marietta X-24 was an experimental lifting body aircraft developed by the United States Air Force and the National Aeronautics and Space Administration between the late 1960s and mid-1970s. It was designed to explore the aerodynamic characteristics of re-entry vehicles without wings, paving the way for future spacecraft like the Space Shuttle. Built by Martin Marietta, the X-24 was a rocket-powered, piloted aircraft that proved wingless designs could be maneuverable and land safely on runways. The X-24 program featured two primary versions, the X-24A and the later X-24B. The X-24A had a rounded, bulbous shape, measuring 24 feet long, with a wingspan of only 14 feet. It was powered by an XLR-11 rocket engine, the same engine used in the Bell X-1, capable of producing 8,480 pounds of thrust. The aircraft weighed about 11,500 pounds at launch. It was carried aloft under the wing of a modified B-52 Stratofortress and released at high altitude, after which it ignited its engine for powered flight before gliding to a landing. The first unpowered glide flight of the X-24A took place on April 17, 1969, piloted by John Mankey. The first powered flight occurred on March 19, 1970. Over 28 flights, the X-24A reached speeds of Mach 1.6 and altitudes up to 71,400 feet. Other notable test pilots included Air Force Majors Gerald Gentry and Cecil Powell. In 1973, the X-24A was rebuilt into the X-24B, which featured a more angular, flat-bottomed shape to enhance stability and lift-to-drag ratio. The redesign made it more similar in layout to the future space shuttle. The X-24B flew 36 times between August 1, 1973 and November 26, 1975. It achieved Mach 1.76 and reached 74,100 feet. Most importantly, it demonstrated precise, unpowered landings from high-speed flight, validating the lifting body concept. The X-24 was part of a larger family of lifting body aircraft, including the Northrop M2F1, M2F2, and HL-10 all contributed critical data to the lifting body program. The X-24's test results directly influenced the design of the Space Shuttle Orbiter, which used similar glide and landing principles. The X-24 aircraft were not designed for spaceflight, but were essential for understanding atmospheric re-entry behavior. Their successful tests showed that a spacecraft could re-enter Earth's atmosphere without wings and still land accurately on a runway. The program demonstrated that pilots could control such vehicles through descent and approach, even at high subsonic speeds. Today, the X-24B is preserved at the National Museum of the United States Air Force in Dayton, Ohio, and the X-24A resides at the Air Force Flight Test Museum at Edwards Air Force Base. Their legacy lives on in modern spaceplane concepts like the National Aeronautics and Space Administration Dream Chaser and the Boeing X-37B. The Martin Marietta X-24 was not just a research aircraft, it was a crucial link between early rocket-powered flight and reusable space vehicles. It combined daring engineering with rigorous testing, setting the stage for future exploration beyond Earth's atmosphere.